We're leaving Port Canaveral and it's an absolute gorgeous morning. There's not much wind and if you can see the, the sea is almost flat calm. Uh, the, the idea is that we head out here and the wind is supposed to be picking up uh, to the northeast. So when we get out about 10, 20 miles, hopefully the wind will be uh, strong enough to sail it by that stage. So, uh, but in the meantime, we're happy not to have any wind against us because we're just motoring out. Camera. All right, so we're putting the haywire twist into the wire leader on a spoon, which we are then going to clip to a two ounce fishing weight behind us as we're cruising at approximately four knots in the hopes of catching a mahi or tuna or mackerel or really whatever he's biting. So I'm just putting the finishing touches on this haywire twist to secure the wire leader to our spoon that we're going to be trolling. And I'm just putting a couple nice square turns around the end to flush it out and put the lock on it. Looks very nice. Are we going to have any other teasers or any other lures going out at the same time? Um, yeah, we might throw out some squid teasers or throw out a, uh, a rigged ballyhoo on a skirt on a hand line. Uh, the ballyhoo will attract the mahi, kingfish, basically anything that's going to be out here feeding will hit a ballyhoo. Uh, the general hope is we don't end up with a shark <laughs> or a barracuda. <laughs> Both of those are undesirable game species. Thank you. We're looking for fish. We keep seeing them. We just want to catch them. Every time we go through one of those fish boils, they dissipate. Yep. They hear us coming and they run. Well, we've got something. It's not incredibly huge, but... Where can I find the gas? Hey, we need the gas. Huh? Uh... I wish I knew what it was. I think it's a false albacore. Huh? I think it's a false albacore. Where you going? Also known as dinner to the cats of Cape Hatteras. Mm -hmm. Does he look bloody? Mm-hmm. Very. He's very dark meat, man. Medium rare, perfect. Brian, what do you think? Mm. Do have a taste? A medium. This is edible. What's the verdict? It's Come edible. on, it's edible. It's good. <laughs> it's fresh fish. Does it taste fishy? No. Does it taste oily? It tastes tuna -y. tuna -y? Yeah. yeah. Tuna. It's got a somewhat oily taste to it. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's, it's good. Okay, good. Yeah. I love tuna. It's passable. It's not as good as the tuna I had last night for dinner, but it's second runner up. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> Well, we went looking for wind, but unfortunately we couldn't find any. If you look out there right now, it's calm as a mill pond. Just fluky winds. We've been motoring since, what, is it 7 or 8 o'clock this morning? And it's 3 o'clock now, and we haven't been able to find any wind to sail by. So we've been motoring most of the day, unfortunately. So we, we had a break just before because we caught a fish. It was really nice just to sit around without any motor going. So, you know, have a look. You got your trophy on film now. Yeah, that's amazing. Trophy is the photo. How do I grab them without getting hurt here? Grab them by the bill. Bill? Yeah? Yeah, get them by the bill. Okay, I got them by the bill. So, yeah, now what? Oh, I gotta get that damn hook out of it. Is he gonna bite me or something? No. 
Mike, what do you think? I'm thinking I'm happy. Is this hard work or what? First thing of the morning? <laughs> what is it, about seven? Right out, about seven, seven. Oh, there he goes. What is he? Oh, another it's another tuna. Probably. Ooh, there's, a, there's a uh, fish underneath him, see ya? Oh, cool. What is that? I barely got oh, these out there. Oh, okay, hold them up, Mike. I want to take a picture of you with her holding them close to you. Yay! <laughs> Let's celebrate! We are just off the coast of, of Florida here near Jacksonville. And we started sailing and these this pod of dolphins joined us. There's must, there must be bloody dozens, oh, about a dozen I guess of them. Some of them are freckled and some of them are just plain. Got a little baby down there, he's cute as one thing, beside his mother. What a way to wake up in the morning. Absolutely incredible. Well, after 24 hours of motoring, which we're sick and tired of, this morning we finally found some wind. And it's totally different to what the forecaster said. He's, he said it was going to be a, an easterly wind. Turned, it turns out it's a westerly wind. And we're doing pretty well. We've got, it's, it's only like 5 to 10 knots at the moment. And we've got um, our drifter up here. And the mainsail, we're doing 4.6 knots, which is pretty good. And uh, these, this pod of dolphin have been following us for um, for a little bit now. They're in and out around the boat. We're only going slow, of course, so they're easily picking us up and going catching fish and then coming back again. So we're having a great time here. We're expected in Jacksonville about another five hours. So hopefully we'll have a have a four or five hour sail before we get there.